Ernest O. Brogstrom was the architect. They don't build them like this anymore. The original blueprints are proof. It's a beautiful piece of architecture. The original Overland Park Presbyterian Church may welcome a new congregation soon. As hotel guests, developers hope to transform the old building, which has been vacant for six years, into a boutique hotel. A post on the City of Overland Park website shows plans for 30 hotel rooms with an eclectic feel and a speakeasy in the building's basement. It's such a symbol of Overland Park from um, basically the 1930s. Brad Moore leads the Overland Park Historical Society. His records show the building has roots dating back to 1929 and bringing it back to life is more than nostalgia for him. It has so much potential for reuse. We have always admired uh, the history of that building so much so that the owners gave us all of the stained glass windows that they removed from the building. An architect on site showed Fox 4 News the interior, which is in pretty good shape. Rendering show part of the hotel would be available for meeting space. This is uh, something that we've wanted and needed for a while. Angie Muti operates the Downtown Overland Park Partnership. She's excited by the business this could bring to the city's unique downtown district. To get a boutique hotel um, is super exciting. We've been wanting one for years now. Um, and especially a boutique hotel because of the vibe that is downtown Overland Park. It's kind of an eclectic, unique um, environment. Moore believes hotel guests will want to learn more about the building's history and in turn more about Overland Park as well. This project still needs city approval. It's due to go before the Overland Park Planning Commission on December 12th in a public meeting. Sean McDowell, Fox 4, working for you.